if everybody and anybody that knows me will know that I am radical and stubborn enough to have believe absolutely in my abilities and that of my team. So I believe as, absolutely. You know, because going into the first game, we virtually knew nothing about um, the Libyan team. All we knew about, all I knew about was that they played a 3-5-2 formation. But I needed to fix, you, you know, um, I know to fix people, you know, to, to the formation that I think I, I had. We went there, we did what we were supposed to do. Unfortunately, we never had our team together. So after we had seen them play, I've seen the video over a zillion times. I think my players will attest to that. So I could replay every part of the game. So I knew what their strong points were. I knew who their strongest player was technically. And we came back home and I knew what we had to do. And kudos to the players. They, adapt, they adapted very fast to what we wanted to do. And it would have been um, a bag full of goals. But fortunately, I think, glory be to God, we got four. Um, from the onset, you know, ever since we came together, I told them one thing. Two goals is the easiest call line to cancel. All we needed to do was to score one goal. We have to go searching for one goal. We can never score two goals at a time. So all we needed to do was to score one goal, cancel that, score another one goal, cancel that, score another one goal. So we kept on scoring one goal. That was just what I told them. We need one goal at a time. And kudos to them, they answered big. They came with four. Well, like I told the players before the game, we better take a good look at ourselves because maybe after today, we might not uh, come together as a group like this. But the greatest joy will be that if we're able to score one goal, we score one goal, we score one goal, we score one goal. We were able to have the bunch together. I invited every one of them. And I think um, we'll wait. Gladly, the snapshot I said they should take of themselves, they will have to redo it again. So Kenya or Sudan, we'll wait. And um, for now, like you said, we don't know which of them is coming. But we believe that uh, which of them comes, we'll be ready for them that's at there. For me, the performance is OK. But the most important thing uh, for me is the team, because the team comes first before, before any players. And the coach side us before the game. He told us the importance of this game. And of course, we have uh, kudos to our fans. Uh, they make the, thing, uh, the game much easier for us. And I'm, I'm happy to have, to have contributed with uh, three goals and an assist. And uh, we just want to pick up uh, from here and build, uh, continue to build on the momentum. Uh, I have, uh, for me, the, the thing that excites me the most because I have uh, last year I have a very difficult uh, season with Bosworth and uh, a lot of people right, wrote me off and uh, I, I think uh, this made me to 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 step up my, my game, step up uh, to the challenges and I think, uh, of course, uh, my form with, with, uh, with my new club is, is, is important for me and I, and I think uh, I was able to justify myself in, in the club and now I have the the, the, the confidence in, in as much as I, I, I know where I'm going to and I want to continue to improve and learn as a, as a young player and I think uh, of course I have, I have uh, more to prove and I have more to learn and I think I just want to continue like this.